Hey there, party people. Welcome back to SJTV. I'm your host, SJ, and I'm so happy you've joined me for yet another review. Now, today is going to be another special day as we are on day four of our series of Dimash and BTS, provided by none other than our subscriber and party person, May Kacha. Now, today we're reviewing the song Akum, which I believe is another beautiful ballad about longing and loving a person and wanting them in your life. So without further ado, let's get into the song. Mmm, nice. Come on, chandelier. <laughs> oh, he got the Justin Timberlake This I Promise You sweater on. I know that's right, Dimash. Come on now, brother. What a beautiful scene. I love, I, I went to art school. What a beautiful setup. Just kind of this loft space, got the paintings all around. Does Dimash paint? Let me know in the chat. Oh, the chandelier is down. The Phantom of the Opera is here. Haven't I said that before, that some of his music reminds me of that musical? That's interesting that that's a chandelier right on the ground there. I'm sure I didn't say that word right. Please don't come for me, Russians. Um, I definitely have to learn this language, at least to sing in it, because it's really pretty sung. Really, really pretty. This has like that, I want to just move like that the whole time. I like it. Swans, okay. I like that it's all in one space. You know, for those of us who are musicians ourselves, it's like it's a lot to do music videos. So for them to do this all in one, I wonder if there's going to be a different scene or is it all shot here? We'll see. Is this the moment we're in another world or we're still in that studio? I think we're still in the studio, guys. Okay, now she in the silk. Okay, or satin. Who's this guy? Is he the, maybe he's a buyer. Maybe he's a buyer of the art. He's like an art dealer or an apprentice. Mm -hmm. 
Now, is this girl famous in Russia? Um, anybody in the comments let me know. She seems like she would be mixed with Russian and Chinese because I know there's a lot of people who are there like that, Australia and also here in Taiwan. So I, I wonder, I wonder. Here he go. Nice shot. Now wait, that seemed like a whole nother song. Let's go back. That transition was so different. It went from like da 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 and then it's just like it's picking up almost towards the end. Interesting. Mm-hmm. It's a whole nother song. The feel I'm picking up is what they're probably trying to convey. If he's about to propose, they're going from the passion to the actual exuberance and joy of proposing. So it's really taking us through the emotions of the feeling um, instead of only giving us something that is going to carry us from start to finish with the same feel, which I feel makes music more interesting. Here we go. He's really killing it on the backgrounds. Let's run that back a little bit. If you guys hear that, oh man. Shout out to you, brother. Mm. That was a lot of fun, you guys. I, I enjoyed that. It, it definitely had a breath of fresh air feel, right? Don't take itself too seriously, but still a love ballad like that's his that's his bag he loves a love ballad and he loves a good vocal and i could tell he loves to sing if you've enjoyed this video today be sure to click this one right here right there